How do you view YouTube end screen annotations on iPhone or Android? Having trouble viewing end screen annotations on YouTube using your Android or iPhone device? Did you know that you can only view end screen elements on your mobile devices using the YouTube app? If you want to reach audiences on both desktop and mobile with interactive calls to action, then end screens are the way to get more subscribers and views. And you want to get more viewers and subscribers, right? Stay tuned and I'll show you how to view end screen annotations on different devices. Here's how the end screen elements appear on my desktop. First, my subscribe image appears. Secondly, my suggested video appears. And thirdly, my squeeze page link appears. Here's what happens when you try to view the end screen elements on YouTube using m.youtube.com, which is the mobile version of YouTube. Here's my video on Facebook. Now I'm trying to view it with my iPhone from m.youtube.com. And as you can see, all the end screen elements don't appear on the video. Now I'm going to view my video inside the YouTube app. So I'm going to click on the YouTube app. So here's my video inside the YouTube app. So I'm going to go to the end of the video. Now I'm talking about the end screen elements at the end of my video. First one that appears is the subscribe element. The second one is the suggested video. And the third one is a link to my squeeze page. So as you can see, I can only see the end screen elements from my iPhone using the YouTube app. Here are all the requirements for viewing end screen elements on different devices. YouTube.com on computers, YouTube Android app version 11.04, iOS version 9, YouTube app versions 11.03 and higher, iOS 8, YouTube app versions 11.09 or higher, mobile web on the iPad devices, YouTube Music, YouTube Kids, and YouTube TV apps are not supported. Flash is currently not supported. Even if viewers have annotations disabled, they'll see the end screens you put on your videos. If you want to learn how to make YouTube end screens, click the card icon above or click the link in the description below this video. Here are three important things to keep in mind. Number one, you can't add end screen annotations to videos that already contain regular annotations. The only way to add an end screen to a video that's already got annotations is to first unpublish it, add the end screen, then republish it. Number two, use end screens in combination with YouTube cards because they're both mobile friendly. Number three, leave 20 seconds at the end of your video to add the end screen elements. That's it, now you know how to add end screen annotations on iPhone and Android devices using the YouTube app. Click this picture to subscribe to my channel so you can receive more videos like this one every week. Click this image to watch related videos. Click this image to download my video upload checklist. You receive a 10-step checklist that will enable you to double your YouTube traffic.